thing we sort of at this working depth n specified in the Parker principle graph, you can only screw up associativity between places where we just don't care about associativity. Okay? And uh, the other operation is in the sort of Parker principle graph. n is actually bigger than the depth of, uh, of p, well, then we can reduce the working depth. p n minus 1 is also a part of the principle graph. So what's going on here? Well, when we reduce the working depth n, suddenly we're, um, we're, we're just forgetting a bunch of associativity conditions. Okay? This is, this is you know, the associativity conditions we insist on here are strictly weak. As long as there were no vertices whatsoever up at depth n, because otherwise we wouldn't even, well, if there were vertices up at depth n, there, there would be some associativity conditions that had to hold here but didn't have to hold here. But if our working depth was actually up beyond the graph, so there were no vertices in the top depth, this works out. Okay. These operations are called reductions. Observations which quickly show us that this set PLD uh, is finite and in fact enumerable, or sort of practically enumerable. So, first of all, 